All right, we are back to do that first mission. We're going to go get that flash drive from Nimble. All right, what have I got on me? Let's lighten the load. Be happy with that. Now, with this, let's do it. All right, now, rather than go through the cordon, oh, it's raining. Oh my God, I love this game. Ooh. Got one of the mutants over there, stuck on a tray. I've got the fan on in this room and I've just had a memory of, uh, I used to, even if, I'm in Australia, right? It's usually hot. I used to blast an air conditioner so that the room that I was in was as cold as possible. So that I could, oh, we got a radioactive zone here, right next, right next to the cordon. Yeah, so that I could rug up, play, kind of, role play stalker while I played stalker. Okay. Oh yeah, I can keep walking while I go to the map. That's where I'm heading to, straight ahead. skyboxes in this game were incredible. It'd be interesting to see how I go with the artifact equipped. Because I'm, uh... Ooh. See, that's interesting. They had the dog bark like it was down the tunnel, but then there wasn't anything in there. The storm is hectic. Got the military over under the bridge. This is the area that there's some bandits in there that we're going to be raiding. That's where Nimble is. Here we go. How many bandits are in the camp? Seven or eight people, two by the gate, two more in the building to the right near the fire. So we that's where they're keeping nimble. Two by the gate, two more in the building to the right near the fire, and another two in the one on the left, that's where they're keeping nimble. Someone usually hangs around the yard as well. Shall we say a prayer and go? Let's go. Men, Wolf here sent us some support along with the odds to attack. Time to move on. Alright, uh, I've never read that properly before doing the mission uh, to know that he's in the building on the left. So that's where I'm going to try to... Those guys are going to head in from that side. There they go. So they're charging in. And I'm going to... Go say hi to these guys. the building on the left. Maybe I should have said no, I'll go in on my own. I've got a silenced pistol. That would have been interesting. Oh, I can see his PDA as well. He's just in here. Alright. Let's do this. I need to medkit. I need to get up in here. Whoa! I found him. Oh, jeez. Okay, shot at. From memory, is there anyone upstairs? Accur accuracy on this thing is atrocious. Oh, 
another one down. These guys. Some bread, why not? Okay. Can I get him up yet, or do we have to clear the camp? I'm going to clear the camp first. Okay. Why do I feel like no one up here? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Slugs for this bad boy, and I want to use them. Whoa, whoa! Alright. Shotgun is OP. Wonder if I can go and find him now. Is he, oh, he had an artifact on him. He's getting all the bodies, because from memory, the other stalkers will also loot. Oh, he's still down and covering. This game feels so good. I love the combat. I forgot that I love the combat. It feels dangerous. Uh, all right, I would say that's gonna be the last of them. Yep, all right. One of my guys is down. Two of my guys is down. I did not give them enough support my own mission. I guess I trusted them to... Oh, whoa! <laughs> Alright, I think I've gotten everything and I think that every single... Oh, uh, sad... So now he's abusing me, but I'm not helping him faster after the gunfight is over. I guess that's helpful though if you didn't know where he was. Save me or what? I owe you, brother. I could never thank you enough. Thanks, brother. You did us a great service. I don't even know how to thank you. Listen, I need that flash drive you were taking to the trader. Do you have it? Yeah, I got it. Those morons can't do a proper search. Take it, you saved my life. All right, sweet. Oh, I can't trade with him. All right, he's got jobs now. Find the perfected suit. Is there a time limit or can I just do it? While I was in captivity, I heard the bandits talking about their secret stash where they keep the haber. Heard they hid, uh, I don't know what haber is. Uh, cool coat there. The next day, some monster got his eye on the stash. Became so interested, they're now afraid to go there. Do me a favor, bring me the suit, and I'll pay you well. I'm up for it. I'm just I'm here for the job. Infected suit. What about this one? Uh, oh wait, no. Okay, I thought I thought I had somehow picked it up during the battle and didn't realize. All right, now I've already searched everyone here. That's the first mission. 
the first uh, little combat there. Wasn't the cleanest. Oh. Got a boar. Come here. Got a shotgun. Should have made it. I do really love the combat in this game. Come here, you. Oh, yeah, there's some dogs out there as well. Alright, let's head back home. It does feel like a big world, like it's just, it's just big enough. To feel open and expansive, and the tricks with the thin barbed wire fence does make it seem like you can go all the way out forever. Maybe that's, because this is my favorite game of all time, and I count it as an open world, maybe that's what games fell into the trap of. Skyrim told everyone, like, make every single spot accessible make a giant map whereas stalker said here's the feeling of a giant expansive map and world but really you only can explore the places that are necessary i think i'll probably take the fence down and have a giant empty boring area there but no yeah, let's pass this in did you manage yeah have you got the flash drive? Here it is. Uh, uh, do you have special missions for me? Mark one. I've done some thinking, and here's what I'd like to. Anyway, here's the thing about Strelok. Uh, there's a stalker that goes by this name. Mm. Uh, they say he's found a path to the northern reaches of the zone. That is a virgin area, a real gold mine for artifacts. Yeah. Anyway, I can help you find him. However, as you can imagine, it won't be a free ride. You'll have to work it off. But in the long run, we'll both benefit. You're going to waste that Strelik fella and find out what happened to you, and I'll find... Uh, well, I mean, I'll get my share of our mutual profit. <laughs> so what do you say? Deal? All right, listen. You mean business, I can see that. And I... I mean, we need guys like you. We're doing sort of an investigation with some other traders. We want to open up a path to the north, to the center of the zone. And near the center, something or someone is trying to hamper our progress. How the heck this Strelok managed to sneak through, I don't know. You see, there's this one area where your brain starts boiling. An eerie place. Anyway, to cut a long story short, a couple of guys have been spying on those grunts for me, not far from here. Apparently the ones at the Agroprom Research Institute have dug up something, something major. I'm positive it has something to do with the center of the zone. Anyway, whatever they've dug up, it's secured somewhere in the third floor of the Institute. And we really need this stuff. You know what I mean? I think so. Alright, third floor. Why don't you have the briefcase? Don't bring it here. Take it straight to the barman. He runs the stalker bar at 100 rads. I'll upload the coordinates and all the data you need to your PDA. Clear? No way. Do you get to the barman this quickly? You'll need to go north through the garbage, then turn west. You'll end up at the Agroprom Research Institute after a few kilometers. And be careful. The radiation level is way too high at the garbage. So I suggest you invest in some anti-rad. Or some vodka. Well, good luck. Alright, that's so interesting. I think when I played this, what I've always done is, especially the first time I played it, I kept coming back to this area and I just kept exploring and doing little missions for every single stalker and filling up my inventory. And, um, yeah, I guess if you're just mainlining, I wonder how quickly you can get through this. Yeah, like all the little jobs. I used to just do these over and over and over again. I don't think you need to. That's interesting. I wonder if we try to play this... If we try to play this just kind of straight. Um, sell all the stuff I don't need, really. Nice. 
Not bad. So he's got unlimited Some money. good stuff you've got there. He's got anti-rads, which I think is worth it. All right. Well, drop by if you get any more. I'll just take a bottle of vodka with me. That'll just be a rule of thumb. I only need canned food. Stack of tan, I'm sure, is fine. I don't need any artifacts that have radiation. It's interesting that you can have them in your bag and not get affected. 200 ammo, probably too much. I weigh so little, though. Let's do 15 of these. How much do they lose? They don't weigh very much either. What well, weighs a lot? The food actually weighs a lot. If I just carry five of those, just try to get a pretty standard kit. 200 ammo, two grenades. I don't usually use grenades, but we'll see how we go. All right, feeling good. Good hunting, stalker. Now, what I would really like to do now is go and find that suit. The bandits had stashed. Oh! One of the stalkers... Oh, look at this. See, this is what I was talking about earlier. So there's stashes, and as you beat people... As you beat enemies, you can find their stash locations. Oh, there's the briefcase. It's just through. I should have just gone there when I was there. Alright, I want to go to this stash. So on the way to this briefcase, I'm going to go to this stash here. So let's go. around. There's two right here. Three right here. Oh my god, there's so many. There's like five. Five or six. Is there somewhere that I can safely... It's like seven. Is there somewhere I can safely fight these dogs from? If I bring them back to the camp, will everyone else take care of them is my real question. Oh, the food icon! I forgot that you do have to eat. See, this is my level of realism that I've always kind of held other games to. Alright, I've eaten. Is there a food gauge? I don't think there's a food gauge. I think it just tells you you're hungry sometimes. Yeah, when it rains, you know, it's not like in DayZ where then you've got to wring your clothes out and find somewhere nice and warm and everything else. Probably a bit much for me. And the hunger meter of just having some food on you. I like food and drink, I don't think. Maybe there is a drink as well. We've been playing a fair bit of DayZ lately, so. Oh, alright, we're gonna. We're gonna make our way through, um, through Anomaly Country. I remember this mission. Active right now, I think that is just that I'm near anomalies. Wait, am I getting radiation? No, I'm not. I think I'm alright going through here. Okay, here's the stash. A science pistol and some ammo. Okay then. Now I gotta safely get out of here. Just shoot at those dogs while I'm over here, get them to run into the uh, anomaly field. 
it is so interesting coming into this game years oh two of those warthogs coming into this game years later i um i remember being enamored like this game was the most amazing thing that had ever existed to me when it came out the the weather and the sky and it just felt like the it was the systems i fell completely in love with the systems in this game but i think that i also um thought they were more than they are in retrospect i think i uh i had imagined that they were more than they actually were and now playing it now older wiser and with newer games out i can see what they actually are what what is actually accessible i think because i was playing you know the graphics were worse because I was, you know, back in the day, worse PC, worse monitors. I remember I bought a new monitor to play this on. It was my first one. Got a 22 inch. <laughs> I think it's still at the back of my parents' house. It was like, that's how serious I was about this game. Running distance is crazy, actually. Whoa. All right, bunch of dogs. One down. The others have run. Didn't drop anything. Wait, isn't there like a psycho dog? I remember there being like a psycho dog that comes out of here, right? That's it. It's like faster, more dangerous. Oh, click the wrong buttons. I don't think I ever thought to just climb on top of things as well back in the day. Yeah, those things are insane. Um, here's the final... The suit. Can I just keep it? What is it? How much better is it than what I've got? It's worth 3,000. Common weak bandit body armor with mail plates sewn in. Almost everyone can do it. Uh, I think because I got that Merc suit... Yeah, mine's better. Jeez. Unlucky spawn. Jeez, that scared me so bad. I'm suddenly, this is the happiest I've been that I'm not doing this with the camera on. It was that moment. Far out. So I'm thinking that they're supposed to jump you while you're running back. And I triggered them while I was still here. God, I gotta go back and hear the noise I made when that happened. Time to return that suit. get them to go into the anomaly. Alright, this has been more chaotic than ever I would have played initially. I used to play it so carefully and save scum way harder. Alright, who am I taking this suit even back to?
Oh yeah, back to the cordon. Okay. Let's go, we'll return this and then I will be done. This is a good level of sprint. There's a good amount of sprint in this game. Oh, the lightning. I've, I've done enough fighting with these mutant dogs today. Okay, here we are, we're home. The cordon. hanging out of the house, isn't he? He is, he's asleep. Wake up, bro. I'm here for the job, Nimble. At the moment, there's nothing. Alright, can I trade? No. Okay, done. Another radiation artifact. Alright, well that was pretty intense. Um, oh, the rain's so loud out here. Gonna hang out here. The the vibe, it's the vibe of this game, is the best thing about it. Being able to go inside because it's raining outside. You don't have to, but you want to. I love it. All right, that was the first mission, and then the little side mission that comes out of it. Uh, I can't wait to keep playing. I'm enjoying this possibly more more than I thought I would for sure, but more than I um ever. Well, it's just different. It's a different way to enjoy it. Alright, I will see you guys on the next one, uh, where we go get over that bridge past the military. Alright, see you guys then.